Now you can see we prune and trim the tree. This is our great tree. And there was big branches here, so if I cut it all off, and you will see how in summer it's gonna grow really fast. Same, these are roses. This is what happened after winter. Then I kind of trim it, I might trim it a bit more, but this is what I got from the grape tree. This is how big it was overgrown. This is from two trees. So now it looks nice and tidy. And I've got my little gardener. Here, yeah. say hello. Yeah. Say hello. Yeah. Say, hello, say I'm my gardener. Try, blue kiss. Ah, so I'm trying to help mommy. And we had dried leaves, all the mess from the grape tree, but the grape tree is nice and tidy. And soon, in a month's time, you will see how it will, it will grow very nicely. We have to keep it short and tiny. Otherwise, uh, the grapes doesn't have enough energy and it's not that big. So as you can see here, this is my second grape tree. And I trimmed it because it was overgrown. That's the root. Yes, so my third one is here. And I'm still doing it because I'm not sure how short I should do this one. So I've got all these from from my third grape tree. And this is a plum. You can see it's gone too way high. Oh, that's a little bit bad. Oh, oh I can't, can't see it on the screen. Anyway, so you can see it's overgrown all these branches. So I'm gonna trim them all and I'll show you the difference. The plum will become really nice and uh, healthy. We'll have a nice healthy plum. So uh, that's my next target. And this is how usually we start tidying up the garden after winter. We're still in February. And uh, after pruning or trimming all the trees, apple tree, grape and plum, what I will do then is uh, pick up everything, tidy up, go check them all in the, uh, in the garbage uh, area. And next will be to do the weeding. Weeds. There's too much weeds everywhere. This is lovely. I forgot the name of this one. Mama. What's happened? Mama. Oh no, what happened to your balloon? Oh, this will happen Mama. after winter. Oh no. Oh, that's in a bad condition. You can see the weeds. So we have a lot of work. Look, another balloon. This is from birthday. Look, one more because we just throw it in the garden thinking it's gonna bloom away oh wow I still have some beetroot rose rosemary this is our compost bin and this is apple needs trimming again you can see this is all these all these grass needs to come off because we have uh, in the ground from here inside you have all flowers I'm not sure whether it's tulips or orchid or something that I'm not sure I forgot what I planted actually so when it comes I will show you I have nice lovely rose there so we need to tidy up make the soil a bit more healthy dig a bit it's a lot of hard work to do and then we have to as you can see this is our shed here I painted it last year white and uh, you can see the fence are gone a bit one is completely one here is completely come off the second one there is completely uh, gone in winter it was too windy this is kind of bending as well this is on our patio and again the fourth one is not very solid so i have to ask hobby to get them replaced this is our trampoline squirrel always coming and biting on the net I replaced it I think uh. year before the net the safety net but it's always something happening I think I leave it this year it's not that bad
now you can see how I trim I trim the plum tree it was quite long so I just chop it in a height that we can reach and pick the plum when we are when the tree is giving us nice healthy fruit girls are back from school and look what's happening here and we can't wait for summer to spend more time in the garden so yes so today's vlog was to show you how we start doing gardening after winter and we usually start in uh, february which is now